Slide number one, Cary Grant, the husband. You wanted to see how I reacted to my wife falling in love with another man. Side number two, Deborah Carr, the wife. I am not a promiscuous trollop. It's never happened before. Side number three, Robert Mitchum, the man. Well, it's quite simple, really. I'm just not very good at resisting temptation. Side number four, Jean Simmons, the other woman. Have you been faithful to her all these years? <laughs> well, it's beside the point. I must apologize for giving you such short notice, but my wife and I wondered if you care to come down for the weekend. How dare he? Why, yes, I think I like that very much. You, you must, must be out of your mind. mind. Shut, Shut up, up and, and go, go and, and sit, sit down. down. The screen's most broad-minded look at a trusting husband, a restless wife, some playful house guests, and what happens when they start playing house in The Grass is Greener. He's done what? He's given her a mink coat. Well, blast him. I hope he rots in hell. I don't trust Victor when he's genial. He is a brute, isn't he? By the way, what did you and Victor do last night? The grass is greener. It's intimate and sophisticated, witty and hilarious. And it takes an uninhibited glance at the manners and morals of a most unconventional foursome. We must look as though we're playing bears. <laughs> <laughs> who's been eating my porridge? And who's been sleeping in my... Yes, but you're asking me to attempt to kill you. I find that monstrous. You're asking me to give up my wife to you. I find that monstrous. Take it off! Lady, darling, I can't. I am going to count. Oh. Three. One, two. I suppose this is what's called being frightened out of one's skin. Yeah.